Hey, uh, welcome back to my channel. I'm a strange one. And basically, yeah, it's June. It's June. We have most people have the, have um, have their pride celebrations, pride parade um, this this month or next month. Um, in fact, my hometown's um, pride parade is is this Sunday, coming Sunday, um, June thirtieth. Uh, it. I personally haven't haven't walked um, in a pride parade before. I'm probably not going going to a game because it, I burn really re really easily, and I ugh, it's just sweaty, ugh, gross. <laughs> Anyhow, um, one of my friends, one of my straight friends, just said, "Oh, so a strange one. Why do you not like?" Um, why are you not so excited about the Pride Parade? Uh, her her reaction was, "You're you're a lesbian. You identify as a lesbian. You like women. You have you have boobs. You like women. You're a bio woman. Why are you so so uh, so unexcited about Pride?" I have several reasons for this. Uh, my first one is just basically that um, the media tends to blow um, blow out the blow up the the craziness of um, of pride um, of the pride parades. You always see guys walking around with their with their junk out. You see topless women in um, you see topless topless women. It's a little off putting. I'm not a prude um, by any means, but it's just off-putting. Not everybody in the community, I don't pres presume to speak for everyone, but not everybody in the community wants to be known as this uh, person who just wants to mash genitals together. So yeah. Uh, second, uh, second reason is that people do get a little bit um, obnoxious about it. Um, as as a lesbian woman, I believe that um, that I am entitled to to walk around with my girlfriend and not be be harassed about it. It's not helping um, the community much when when people are going, "Oh, look at me, um, look at me, and look at how um, how much how much cock and how much." How how many tips are hanging out? So yeah, it's not it's not pleasant. Um, la uh, thirdly, um, I really don't like that the uh, that the community is basically um, that Pride Parade has a big focus on gay gay males, whether they be bio males or or trans trans males as well. Um, it's just kind of funny because everything every everything is catered to um, to gay males um, within the community uh, in fact some of the clubs uh, most of the clubs in in our gay district in my hometown are catering to gay males I I had to do I had to look up with several for for a friend and most of them I mostly encountered flash websites with like half naked buff guys and I'm just like going hmm, this is interesting uh, and lastly roughly the um, I believe that the trans community is very misrepresented mis in every in every uh, pride parade uh, you have like the the drag queens and the drag kings. They may not be trans. Um, that's the problem. People can't. M most people can't distinguish between between trans and cross dressers and and people who who are performing. Basically, uh, most people most people really can't distinguish between those two, and they kind of lump everybody under the same category and trans people trans people 
trans women and trans men also deserve a little bit more respect. Um, I am going to be uh, filming a little bit at uh, my hometown's Pride. It's going to be quite interesting, mind you, but I am not a. I am not. I am going to be filming uh, with a user named Up All Hours uh, Nine. She's uh, a trans woman. Basically, uh, yeah, it's her, it's going to be her first pride, her first actual pride, and I'm gonna show her around and sort of and sort of be involved in that. Um, however, I I'm gonna be out there. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be sporting a, a t-shirt, a tank top, maybe, and a couple of and sunglasses because it's going to be hot as usual. So yeah, the, those are the reasons why I don't like, I'm not that enthusiastic about pride. I believe a quote from the L word suits, uh, suits very, very well here. We have more, we have more um, hate than pride. <sighs> well, I think I'm proud of of gay culture and how far it's come, considering that um, in our culture, at least in Western culture, in other countries, I don't even want to think about it. I'm proud to be um, Canadian, but the U.S. and everywhere else just makes me very concerned because people seem to be concerned. Uh, people seem to be concerned about what we do in bed with other people. It's no concern of the. It's no concern about of who we love. But there really isn't. I think just just part of my apathy for for pride is just basically how how people tend to act and how people tend to treat this as as a chance to hook up with someone or or like get laid or do something else and it's just no the the gay scene at least for me is just it's about celebrating culture celebrating diversity and yeah well our mayor you may our mayor the uh, mayor Ford basically uh, I don't think he's gonna be making an, an, an appearance but the guy is the guy is interesting. Every year, um, it comes around to to uh, to gay pride. He always makes an excuse. He is always off with his family in in like the cottage, and he's always going. Oh, he's very very smart politically, but I don't get get behind the fact that he doesn't have the have the guts to say say I'm I don't like. I don't, I don't approve of, gay, of of the LGBT scene. He doesn't have the guts to stand up and say, "I don't approve." I'm not gonna show up there. He always makes this weak ass excuse of of actually going. Oh, I could appear. I'm busy with family matters, but that's about it. The man is very. The man is very uh, astute, politically astute, but. The guy has a lot of scandal now, considering that um, that in, he's been allegedly caught smoking smoking crack. Um, and frankly, I think I think the man needs to be out of office. I really do. But yeah, what can I say? He he doesn't have the guts to say. You know what? I don't approve of the gay uh, gay community screw off. <laughs> he just has to make a weak ass excuse anyway. So yeah, um, this is just my little rant on on how I feel about uh, Pride Parades. You um, stay tuned for a couple of videos on on location um, with, as I said, up all hours. Um, nine. She's a wonderful camera, camera woman and basically 
will be will be set up doing that. Um, also, also um, a few uh, uh, a few of you have have been saying, oh, so what has happened? I'm just basically a little busy with school. I'm trying to find work right now, which is the nope. Nobody wants to hire hire somebody who is as old as I am and who who is overqualified for half of the stuff. They rather hire people out of high school. Um. So yeah, looking for temporary work doesn't work. And yeah, I will be back in school in September. I'll be making videos also. Um. So yeah, look forward to to new videos, uh, new gaming videos too, because I have to have to get some um, some of my equipment back up. Anyhow, it's a strange one. Signing off and take care.